We did a two-way independent sample ANOVA, we did two-way repeated mayor ANOVA, but there are many conditions or situations and real-world problems when we are solving or addressing problems that when we have two different variables, or we have independent level variable and we have repeated level measurement. For example, if I have seen what gender differences are across three different treatment interventions for the depression, उसके अंदर हमारे पास फिर थ्री डिफरेंट इंटरवेंशंस जो हमारी हैं इंटरवेंशन वन टू वन थ्री दे वुड बी रिपीटेड मैया बट जेंडर वुड बी इंडिपेंडेंट और बिटवीन ग्रुप वेरिएबल सो देर मे बी मेनी सिचुएशंस वेयर वी हैव अ कंबाइंड इंडिपेंडेंट वेरिएबल एज वेल एज द विद इन सब्जेक्ट वेरिएबल uh, when a design includes uh, some independent variable that is measured using different entities and others that use repeated measure, it is called mixed. So, when we have independent variable, ko, independent group, ko, or uh, within group, we have to make a mixed ANOVA. Ban jata hai. Or, uh, this is technique and an extension of the repeated measure design. So, when we have analysis in spaces, ke andar, we will be doing it in repeated mayor, but that allow us to have a, a between group variable as well as within group variable. Remember that when we have independent ANOVA, that we have every group in our group, ke andar, individuals different, hai, that is called between group. And when we have one of the subjects in every kind of level condition, ke andar hai, jisko hum repeated mayor, bolte hai, that is also called a within group uh, design. So, for example, a researcher wants to investigate the impact of intervention on client's anxiety level using pre, post, and um, pre-test and post-test, but I also like to know whether the impact or is different for males and females. वो ही बात होगी कि वो कोई भी आपने intervention या कोई therapy है जिसका आप effect देखना चाह रहे हैं यानी आपने pre-testing की फिर आपने therapy दी और post-testing की और आप देखना चाह रहे हैं कि pre और post में कितना difference है this is a repeated mayor design because you are using the same subject, you tested them, then you introduced the intervention, then you tested again the same participants. But you also want to see that across males or females, mein, is therapy ka different, kis se, uh, difference is different. So you have a male and a female, of course, males are different, females are different. So now it is a mixed design, two into two. So we have two variables. One is the type of uh, therapy or intervention which two levels hai. the second independent variable which is between group variable is gender which two levels are male and female so we'll be having two into two mixed ANOVA design uh, you may explain that we have one between subject variable hai, jo ke gender hai, one within subject variable hai, jo ke time hai, time one time two or pre post testing we have to this analysis is also called split plot ANOVA ya phir hum isko mixed between within subject ANOVA ya simply mixed ANOVA bhi kehte hain. Mixed design require at least two independent variables. One is a between group and one is the uh, within group variable. Uh, but we can have more complex scenarios too jahan pe hamare paas do independent variable ho aur ek repeated mayor ho ya fir do repeated mayor variable ho aur ek hamare paas independent group design ho so fact anova ki bahut sari variety hai bahut extend kar sakte hain aap factorial 3 into 3 into 3 kar sakte hain aur fir uske andar again aap between group aur within group variables le sakte hain uh, assumptions हमारे ANOVA की more or less वही रहती हैं जो हमने बात की थी normality की हमने बात की थी independence की random sampling की underlying normal distribution की लेकिन ANOVA में एक assumption आपने देखा कि हमारे पूरे lectures में homogeneity of variance बड़ी important है अगर वो uh, independent groups हैं तो हम कहते हैं कि Levin's test हम use करेंगे और अगर हमारे पास repeated measure है तो हम Mochley test हम separacity का use करते हैं लेकिन अब हमारे पास uh, mixed design hai hamare paas in between group variable bhi hai aur hamare paas within bhi hai so we will not only be calculating levin's test for the independent group mochley test for the uh, within group but also for the interaction we will be adding another uh, assumption of the ANOVA which is called 
होमोजेनाइटी ऑफ द कोवेरियंस या इंटरकोरलेशन कोवेरियंस का मतलब है कि फॉर ईच ऑफ द लेवल ऑफ द बिटवीन सब्जेक्ट वेरिएबल द पैटर्न ऑफ इंटरकोरलेशन अमंग द लेवल ऑफ द विद इन सब्जेक्ट वेरिएबल इज द सेम और इसको टेस्ट करने के लिए हम बॉक्स टेस्ट ऑफ इक्वालिटी ऑफ कोवेरियंस मेट्रिक्स यूज करते हैं जब आप एस पी एस एस में जाके क्लिक करते हैं कि वो होमोजेनाइटी ऑफ वेरियंस कैलकुलेट करें तो उसके आउटपुट फाइल में ऑटोमेटिकली वो आपको लेवेंस टेस्ट का भी बॉक्स देगा आपको मोशले टेस्ट का भी बॉक्स देगा और एडिशनली आपको वो बॉक्स टेस्ट ऑफ इक्वालिटी ऑफ को वेरियंस मेट्रिक्स भी देगा so now in the next uh, uh, tutorial we'll be entering data in spss and we'll be running uh, mixed anova